Hawa nikuulize. Mm. Dana huyo kijana anasemekana alikuwa anaishi hapo kwa hiyo plot yenye unafanya. Mm. Aliama. Mm. Na ni uko na ni ukweli mtoto wake alikuwa kidnapped ama ni 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 ni, ni story tu. Tu ni story tu. Oh, kwa hivyo ni story yako kuwa kidnapped. Eh, yeah, ni ni story ya niku ask. Sio ndio ki ask kama mwenye Zora alikuwa anasema Zora amekufa anaenda kumzika hivyo. Mm. Watu wangu wa nguvu welcome back to JK Galo TV na kama kawaida tumekuja kufichua leo ficho so guys mambo imeendelea kuchemuka sana hii saidi ya Breton the PL na tumeza kuona Breton the PL ameza ku hmm, ameza kufungua another video pale hivyo katika channel yake the video was all about eh, vile sasa Fei will resurrect and come back na sasa hiyo ni after amekuwa exposed na the truth watchdog. So tukiende hiyo side nyingine naye the caretaker ambaye alikuwa amekazia truth watchdog kwa access the CCTV footages na ambao wanashukiwa waliweza ku delete the CCTV footages ameza ku open up through a phone call. So alipigiwa na best yake simu na the friend alikuwa anaulizia akimwambia ameza kumona YouTube kwa channel ya Watchdog na alikuwa anaweza kumwambia amweleze how was the story about her na Truth Watchdog so pale hivyo ndiye aliweza ku open up akasema Truth Watchdog ni kama alikuwa anaonea Breton the PL video wivu not video wivu cause Breton the PL and Angie B walikuwa anafanya acting too just to make sure that wanaendeleza content creation yao na wameka creativity yao to the great level so guys but according to Breton the PL e kitu ilikuwa inaonekana ni kama ni serious the guy was serious the guy was demanding the funds na guy alikuwa anaitisha ile hmm, ile harambe serious alikuwa anaingia live watu wachange so hakuna mali alisema hiyo ni acting maybe imerelisiwa season 1 ama season 2 kitu nyali alisema alisema hiyo kitu hiyo kitu ni real na bado alirudi kwa kamera akin sister akisema watu wenye wanajaribu kumfight god will pay them so tumeza kuona all the stories zimeza kufichuka na sasa wacha tusikize ile phone call ambayo kiateka alikuwa anapigiwa simu na bishte yake na tusikie zile vitu ambazo alisema so guys wacha niwapeleke pale direct niwapeleke pale direct at least mpate the story of what is going on here hmm? musikie ni story na na huko youtube na kuona na huko naona katendo huko ya mimi eh Aje yani? Ninakuwa na mali kwa kwa nini kwa YouTube. Kwa kisema aje. Okay, explain. Ah, au ni wakona au wanaweza kunikula tu kichwa. Kwani kuna kwani kunaenda aje? Na kijana alikuwa na ask, sasa ku ask kama au watu sema mshanga amekufa, sasa unajua ku ask hivyo ni ana acting. Eh. So umesikia saa hizi kiateka anasema huyo kijana alikuwa na act but ile siku ambayo truth watch dog aliweza kuingia huko hivyo kiateka alikuwa amemkalia mkali sana ako anataka aweze kuingia kwa that plot na aweze ku access the CCTV footages cause walikuwa na feature the evidence na inakaa pia the kiateka was paid cause kama kiateka angelipwa angeza kazi ya truth watch dog na angeza ku delete hizo footages so it seems that this lady aliweza kupatiwa pesa mzuri ili aweze kuficha evidence yote cause the truth watch dog alikuwa ameza kuenda huko na alikuwa ready to expose everything so wacha tusikize vile anaendelea kusema then tujue sasa ni ule mtu anamuonea jealous ehe mmm ule mtu anamuonea jealous sasa kumbe alikuwa na record na si atijui oh ni kuulize Huyo 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 kijana huyo kijana anasemekana alikuwa anaisha hapo kwa hiyo plot yenye unafanya aliama na ni na ni ukweli mtoto wake alikuwa kidnapped ama ni 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 story tu ni story tu oh kwa hivyo ni story
ni hakukua kidnapped eh ni ni sorry yani ku ask so ana ku ask kama mwenye zora alikuwa anasema zora amekufa anaenda kumzika hivyo mm eh alafu unajua mm kitu unaona huyo 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 jamaa alikuwa huko mm huyo jamaa alikuwa amekuja kufuatilia hiyo story mm kitu anasema kitu yenye yeye inamuuma ni huyo uh, jamaa kudanganya eti mtoto amekuwa kidnapped ni, ni vizuri kuwa act but kitu yenye inamuuma ni huyo uh, jamaa anadanganya watu anamchangia hakuna kaweka huko yule wivu jangu kwa kijana kadao hata kajafikisha dati ya sasa nani ana wivu hiyo ni so nasikia vile kiateka anasema kiateka bado ana insist ule kijana ambaye ni Brighton ni kijana mdogo jafikia 30 years so the truth which dog alikuwa amemuonea wivu that's why alikuwa na follow up that story nyinyi kama viewers mnakubaliana na that statement hebu tupatie maoni yenu pale hivyo kwa comment section na tujue cause truth which dog tumeona amekuwa akifuatilia stories za watu wengi this is not the first story kufuatilia but this guy ameweza kufuatilia stories mob sana even za wale maskamas wa trading wa Binance wale kina kina Sami Boy ameweza kufuatilia ni stories mob sana so i don't think ame niza kwa ni wivu imem drive kwa Brighton cause the truth which dog mwenye alisema my fans ndio aliweza kumtag na alikuwa anamwambia aweze kufanya ile story ya Brighton aweze ku follow up ndio ajue kama ni kweli so acha tuendelee kusikiza na tuendelee kupata hmm, evidence mob you caretaker ana open up ana open up kabisa na ende alikuwa amesema hakuna story yote iliendelea kwa hiyo plot acha tuendelee kusikiza juu hiyo acting ilikuwa aje sasa nani anaonea mwingine wivu Uwe jamaa huyo jamaa anasikia anasikia kutoka anasikia uchungu ni nini mkwani mtoto ni wake Oh yeye yeah, anaonea huyo jamaa wivu Eh hata ameniambia ati ananiletea maaskari mandi Huyo <laughs> huyo jamaa wewe unamjua vizuri Mimi <laughs> mjui Na anasema anasema eti anasema eti umlisema eti uli, uli, anasema eti muli nini muli delete nini footage ya CCTV Eh yeah. Nani alidili? Ye, yeah, we, ni kunoma. Umesikia the caretaker mwenyewe ameweza kusema wali delete the CCTV footages. Wali delete, so acha tusikize nani alidelete na mbona wali delete. Delete. Huyo kwa na zake, si wali delete. Sasa mtu kama hizo zinamuhusiwa na nini? Kwanza yule plot huo mwenye inafaa apate ukijana penye alikuwa anaishi si saa hii huko penye tu. Hata boga alisema akimpata ni kushikwa. Oh mwenye plot sasa. Eh. Eh, anakuja kukufanya na wajeze kama ni jambazi. Ah, si jambazi. But mimi si mjui vile na muonanga tu huko YouTube. Ni mukora huyo mulu ya mukora. Jaro mulu ya kama huyo mpumbavu. Oh, so wakati yeye alikuja huko kwa plot yenu alikwambia nini? Wewe hey, okay, ataka manze. Umesikia vile amesema the truth of dog ni mlio mkora je una mlio mpumbavu kama huyo. Na ile story ya ku delete CCTV footages amejikoroga anasema hiyo vitu hata ina maana na imuhusu but we know that CCTV footages ndio u pena evidences ya evils zote ambazo zimefanyika if kama ingekuwa ni ukweli familia Breton the PL ilikuwa kidnapped na kote ingeweza ku demand wale watu waweze kuoneshwa wangetisha the CCTV footages but why they are deleting the footages if it's true familia yake kidnapiwa so unaona mali ujanja inampotelea ni hapa hivi hapa hivi ndio ajejeleza vizuri na ajui kitu nyamekuwa akisema hapo cause the landlord himself ndiye alikuwa akipigia walikuwa akiongea na the truth watch dog na kesema ule kiateka ndio ako na access ya that CCTV na yeye ndiye anajua everything na ile wakati alimwitisha password alimwambia kuna mtu amebiwa nguo pale na nataka review the footages so kama hiyo CCTV inatumika ku review the footages kama emergency imefanyika mbona mdelete zile footages zingine kama hakuna kitu fishi mlikuwa mnaficha so umeona mali mambo inaribikia ni hapo hivyo na still bado anasema the landlord amesema truth watch dog aseze kuonekana hapo na tuliona landlord mwenyewe ndiye aliweza kumpigia simu na kemtuma akemtuma fifth floor do h15 aende confirm the lady mwenye ako pale hivyo so guys history na bamba sana wacha tuendelee to expose kila kitu 
Kati watu natafuta sijui mtu fulani sijui atiko hapo kuna mstari hadi kitapione kama mimi ndio na kitu kama hiyo na desk ya nikamwambia kama uko na pesa ya kutuma tuma sasa nikuulize unajua hii story nimeiona imenichanganya sasa nikuulize kijana mwenye mwenye kuama mwenye kusema mtoto alikidnapiwa na bibi yake ilikuwa uongo ni, ni kuact walikuwa wana haki ah, si uongo si hata hadisi yake walikuja akasema ni kuact akamwambia oh ni sawa oh mm. sasa kama mpigio hadisi yake akaniambiwa asikutishie akikuja manda ina mimi niambie nimkujie eh, eh. eh. asikulete hivyo ndio ameniambia oh mm okay Ah, uh, hiyo story kwa hiyo. So guys, hiyo ndio story na tunasikia kiateka anasema that pia DCI waliweza kufika kwa hiyo plot yao na walikuwa wamekuja kuangalia Breton the PL na Breton the PL aliweza kuelezea akiwaambia that was acting na after that the DCI waliweza kuenda na kuna kitu kingine yote waliweza kuulizwa na hapo sasa tulisikia the truth which dog aliweza kutukonfirmia kituambia ule DCI ambayo ule kiateka anasema is not the real DCI wameweza ku find out na wamefanya investigation au si ma DCI ni ma DCI ambao wamefekiwa cause pia anasema kuna polisi pale alikuwa na impersonate police alikuwa anaitwa Gideon Gideon is not a police officer ni mtu tu hivi hivi alikuwa na act pia kipindi. So pale hivyo kumekuwa na kipindi mrefu sana ambayo ime last for long na this is the end of the era. This is the end of the tray. <laughs> Nasema this is the end of the horror. Hey, imekuwa noma sana. Kama uje watch movie, hii movie imekutosha ungeanza kuwatch na ubambike na umalize stress zako zote. So guys, that's the only story nilikuwa niwaletee. So I'm really really grateful for the fans when you wanazidi ku comment pale for the fans when you wanazidi ku subscribe daily today for the fans when you wanaendelea ku support pia wale ambao wana comment vibaya na washukuru sana cuz bila nyinyi singekuwa na audience na bila nyinyi singekuwa na watch time So thank you so much kama bado unaendelea comment vibaya comment vibaya but no the truth is over Tumeweza kuletea truth nyenye mlitaka na mmeweza ku demand mnataka fee. So fee ndio bado tunamtafuta. And I promise you very soon fee anakuja kutokea kwa kamera. Mtaona fee akitokea kwa kamera, the real fee. Wacheni vile mnasikia saa hizi fee fee. Mtaona the real fee akitokea kwa kamera. So thank you so much guys for those who watching the video make sure that you subscribe na umering the notification bell so that you can be able to get more and more videos.